Sup guys, this is Jimmy Displaying. Today we review the Airblown Inflatable 2019 six foot tall sparkly swan. Now before I get to the inflatable, the reason why I hadn't uploaded anything in a while is because I had life issues and stuff like that. So, but anyways, um, I got this inflatable obviously from Lowe's uh, about four, three, four years ago. And as you can see right here uh, on the bottom right corner right there, got the inflatable for $99 and I think I blew it up once I think as soon as I bought it and it was it was a pretty cool inflatable I'm not sure if it worth 99 I mean if it does it'll probably be the very most I'll spend my money on but most likely should worth maybe like 79 maybe 89 or something like that but as you can see right here it has the sparkly material on the wing of it and it's fuzzy plush material on one side of it think on the right side but overall really cool inflatable it means nothing to brag about to your friends or nothing but still pretty cool to look at kids will like it and yeah let's go ahead and get this piece of crap out of the box i couldn't check the fan of this but i'm thinking as a yf80 uh judged by how the fan sounds but it lights up pretty good as you see even without the uh without the room being turned off. All right, uh, here he is. When it said it was six foot, it looks a tad over counting the crown, maybe about by a good inch or two. But it's per it's a bit bigger than you think it is. I mean, on the box, kind of looks small. It's one of those inflatables where it looks small on the box, but in real. Like if you see it in person, it's actually a bit bigger than you think. And the length of it from the chest of the swan to the tail is probably six foot long as well. Its width is probably around eh, about three, three, maybe four feet wide or so from the left wing to the right wing. But it's a pretty cool inflatable. I mean, I don't know why I got it. I mean, I guess because... I was desperate to get more inflatables and stuff because at the time I didn't really have that many inflatables. So I started to go and get this. I was going to get the penguin, like the Nom Nom penguin or whatever you call it from Lowe's as well. That was in the uh, same aisle as this inflatable was. But for some reason I decided to choose this one because I guess it just looked better. And It definitely does mean I'd rather get an inflatable that's more detailed and stuff with sparkly material on the wing of it and fuzzy plush material on the right side of it then just get some random penguin and inflatable that's similar animation to the nom nom chipmunk and crap or whatever it's called but there's really not too much to explain about this it's just a pretty cool inflatable and i'm not sure how many c7s it has I'm not one of those people who waste their time by counting how many c7s an inflatable has but what i will do i'll show you the left side of this inflatable and as you see right here um it doesn't have any fuzzy plush material on this side or anything special just a regular inflatable but not my favorite inflatable but at the same time it's not the worst i had it's pretty mediocre for my collection but uh but yeah like share subscribe and buy and i'll try to upload more videos soon so stay tuned